Hello everybody, Burnt Out Guy here, and welcome back. Alright, so I went and downloaded the Halo World, uh, the mashup pack there. Alright, so I'm going to kind of do like a little bit of my own little review on it, and give you my thoughts about these mashup packs. Um, eventually I'm going to go think I'm going to go through all of them, and I'll maybe do the same thing with the skin, with the um, uh, texture packs. So, let's start off here, we'll uh, keep it on peaceful... We'll put it on uh, creative so we can just kind of like fly around this place and have a look at what it looks like. Um, yeah, alright. So let's go. Let's give her. Now, the first thing I have a comment about is the the menus here. You know how they, they just change the color of them? I'm sure they can do better than just changing a tint and, you know, just adding some nice little colors to it. I'm sure they can do that. And there's a few things. Okay, this is kind of interesting. This is like one of the little pods you land in. Hmm. Well, that's not bad. Not bad. Alright. Alright, so another thing I don't like about mashup packs is uh, when you go and... Let's go down to the wool here. Let's see the wool. See what they do to the wool. I wish they would just create new blocks and add them into the game, which I'm probably sure they're capable of doing that, but whatever. These torches look pretty nice. Not too bad, not too bad. What's in here? We got a music disc, a jukebox, and an iron sword. Oh, I like what they did with the swords. That looks nice. Alright. That looks nice. <laughs> Alright, I'm just going to walk around with this thing on just because of freak, yeah. Oh yeah, beast. That's killer. Good job. Good job. I like that. All right. So there, you got a plus. You got a plus just because of the way you did this weapon. Good stuff. All right. So I'm assuming they're gonna watch you to walk around here. What a nice. It's not a bad world. It's a nice little generated world. Hmm. What's this? It's like one of those little flying ships with the buddies on it. You'd have the guys like on the side here jumping out, shooting at you. Nice drop ship. Not too shabby, not too shabby. Well, the blocks colors actually don't look too bad. Uh, they're pretty nice. Hmm. Not bad, not bad. Let's see what else is around this world. I guess I was supposed to probably kind of walk this way. Eh? Let's kind of see what's going over here. This bridge. Hmm. One of these blocks with the circles on them. Hmm. Cool animals. What the hell did they do to you, Piggy? Seriously. You okay? You feeling okay? Oh my lord. They butchered you. Oh. You got horns now, so now you're a bull. So they give you a sex change. Look at that. Look, he's got balls. See that? He's got balls. They're square, but he's got balls. Oh my god. <laughs> That's hilarious. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Enough of that. Let's go. Let's go over here. Uh, we got a chicken. Oh, wow! I'm gonna drop some paint. What happened to you? My lord! You look nasty. Okay. All right. All right. That's interesting. Very interesting. I'm kind of liking that little beam thing in the back there. It's starting to look kind of pretty sexy. Alright, let's kind of make our way over this way. So I'm assuming you'd probably have to walk through this ravine to get over here. Oh, pretty cool. Pretty cool. I remember these buildings. Yeah. I've played like a lot of Halo. I am I don't know if I've played all of them, but I've played quite a bit and I'm not like super beast at it, but I I do like the game and I'm not bad player. But um Yeah. I like this. It's not bad so far. I'm actually kind of impressed. I seem to have put a lot of effort into this map, which is nice to see. I'm very proud of that. I I was kinda of you know, hoping they wouldn't have butchered it. But they did pretty good so far. Oh, nice big long tunnel. Where's this going to? Oof. This map is pretty massive. Pretty massive. I like how they had that tunnel going through there. That was pretty nice. Alright. 
Oh, they pretty did some nice work on the structures, anyways. Not too shabby. Wonder if these are glowstone lamps. Oh, they probably are. Let's see what those are. Those look really nice. Let's go into here. Oh, redstone lamps are here. All right. So what are the ones with the circles on it? Because they seem to like give off light. Ah, glowstone. Huh. Okay, that's not bad. Not bad. It's pretty cool. Kind of liking this so far. What else do they give you? Oh, wow, let's check out the armor. I forgot about the armor. Duh. Oh, wow. All right. Let's go with the diamond here. See what you look like. I forgot to totally forgot to check these out. We got the hoe, the axe, the pickaxe, and the shovel. Yeah, that's all we're missing in here. Eh? Flint and steel looks kind of nice. A bow. Oh yeah. Is, is that like one of those needlers? Oh, it is too. Oh my god. Okay, wait, 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 wait. I'm actually enjoying this. This is nice. Alright, so let's put that armor on. Oh yeah. That looks pretty good. Not bad, not bad. So, I'm assuming that this one would be like probably the closest to the Master Chief there. The normal leather one. And then after that, you get into some kind of funky ones there. Helmet looks pretty good on that one. Same with that one. You look kind of like a stormtrooper with this one on. <laughs> uh, right on. Right on. Compass is pretty interestingly done. Made like a radar. That's pretty cool. So this an arrow. Oh, made it look like a needler. Oh, very nice. I gotta get that. Alright. Check this out. Alright. Look at that. Too bad it doesn't shoot like a needler. Oh, they still have that kind of uh, arrowy look to them, though. Hmm. But still not bad. Interesting how you're able to pick them up out of the wall now. I didn't know you could do that before. I thought once you shot them into a wall or something that they stayed there. But that's kind of cool. You can go down and... Oh my god, this map is pretty awesome. Alright, well, I'm curious. I want to see what this thing is. Curiosity has killed me. Sorry, people. But they got a nice little map going on here so far. Looking pretty nice. Is that just like a background? They give it a background? Or is that an actual structure? That looks like a structure. But it could be just a background. Let's go find out. It's not loading very fast, though, I th think. Wow, loading chunks is really slow. Oh, I think I've hit the edge of the map. Is it possible? Yeah, I did too. So that's a background texture that they used. Huh. Pretty good. Actually had me convinced and fooled that there was an actual something back there. That's pretty good. Change the moon? Or is that just like a planet? Hard to say. Oh, that's kind of funky, eh? Look at this. They connect. There's one on each side. Oh, that's brutal. That's pretty brutal. Alright, let's go check out some of these walkers here. Oh, wow. Not bad, not bad. Pretty good job. It's pretty nice. I'd like to see somebody put that onto the PC and make it walk. I bet you that would be freaking awesome with those slime block uh, functions that they got going on now. Wow. That's pretty cool. It's pretty cool, man. Not bad. I like this kind of stuff. This is pretty neat. Then we got our our hoe. Let's just turn around here so we can see what it looks like. Everybody likes to see a good hoe. Um, and then we got that's the axe. Yeah, not bad, not bad. The pickaxe looks pretty beast. I like that. That looks pretty nice. And what was this a shovel? Hmm, interesting. Why? That's like my all-time fave. This thing right here, or the needler. It looks very, very cool. Hmm, <laughs> awesome. All right. So what else is in this little world? Hmm. No, I'm kind of like skimming over this there. Try to have a look at everything. I don't want to like you know miss too much, and I don't want to spend too much time checking this out too because it's probably a pretty big map. So, but it seems really cool, anyways. Um. I got not too many complaints on it. They made the dirt look a little bit different, which is nice. Um, 
I don't know. Looks kind of reddish. An off-world tint. But it's not bad, not bad. Alright, what else is in here? Gotta be something else. Alright, we got this big-ass building over here. Right on. What's in here? Hmm. But you can go inside that. Is that one of those big guns? Or is it just a building? That leads to another big-ass building. Is that just a run up and down on, or can you actually get in there? Uh, I don't think you can get in there. Maybe it's just a run up and down on. Yeah, I think that's all it is. Mm, like a dam. That's what that reminds me of. One big ass dam. Nice. Oh, we got ourselves a warthog here. Sweet. <laughs> not bad, not bad, not bad at all. Not too shabby. Too bad these things didn't actually move. That'd be kind of neat. Hmm. Well, they did pretty good on their structures. Uh, I'm going to have to say that they did put some nice time and effort into that. It's nice to see. This kind of reminds me of one of the first maps they actually kind of get to play on. Um, in most of the, the Halo games, like, they have that first little on-world uh, when you're on the Halo itself there. I see a door over here. Where does this lead to? Leads to you do something, you don't do nothing. Let's go down this way. Oh, it's just another way. Uh, Alright. I don't know if I've been here. It's possible. But I'm actually kind of liking this. They, the, it's pretty nice. Did a pretty nice job. And what's this thing over here? That's kind of interesting. Nice little building structures. I guess it's their, like, pyramid version of... for Halo. Yeah, not too bad, people. Not too bad. Alright, I'm gonna have to give you a thumbs up on this on there, 4 j It's not too shabby. But, there are a few little complaints. Why are these anvils blue? Like, what is this supposed to be? Hmm. Some destroyed ship, maybe? Uh, that's possible. Oh, there's more stuff. There's all kinds of little gadgets and ships and stuff like that that they got in here. Hmm. That's pretty neat. I'm liking this. Really liking this. Lots to explore, lots to look at. Yeah, pretty cool, pretty cool. Looks like they spent some good time and effort building this stuff there. I like it. I like it. Good stuff, good stuff. Yeah, no complaints. Um, yeah, so, alright, let's talk about these blocks. Alright. Um, I like how you change some of the, you know, things to make it look nice and blah, blah, blah. But like I was saying earlier, these uh, pieces of wool there, you, you really, really, come on. Can we stop changing these and come up with some newer blocks to add into these? Because I'm sure it would help you make all kinds of different things. It can't be too hard to add a block to a game. Come on. Seriously. I'm sure you can come up with all kinds of different blocks and and you know it's just for the mashup pack. It's you know, you know like come on, give a little bit more variety. But I really like in these pillar things in the back. That's really nice. Very 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 nice. And I guess that was the moon earlier that I was seeing unless it was like a daytime planet that you only see during the day, which is kind of odd. I think you'd see it at night too, but whatever. Whatever. Yeah, I'm liking this. I wonder how big this map is. Let's check this map out. Ah, get over here. Alright, so we're in the top corner. Oh, alright. i got a long way to go. Alright, so uh, I'll just kind of like have a little look-see around here and see if we missed anything else. But yeah, so far I like it. They did a pretty good job. I just don't like how chunks load up so bloody slow now. Look at that. Ugh. I don't know. But, yeah, good job so far. Uh, I was over here already. So I think I've pretty much well seen everything on this map. So, yeah, with that said, I think it's is a nice job they did on the uh, on this Halo. Congratulations, 4J. You didn't disappoint me. Um, I'm happy with that. And now we'll see about the other ones. Um, the Skyrim one was well done. I, I kind of like that one too, but... 
Yeah, we'll get to those in another video. Oh, another structure I did not see. Hmm. You know, the, I, I like it. I really do. Um, yeah, I really do like this. This is pretty good. Pretty good. So yeah, other than like the changing of the blocks, like the... Uh, what the hell? Um, what are they called? Oh yeah. <laughs> oh my god, this is horrible. The wool blocks. Uh, shortage of memory sometimes. I laugh at it. I think it's just so stupid because I got the words like right on the tip of my tongue. Yeah, other than the changing of the, the wool blocks and the HUD, you know, I'm pretty sure they could do better than just changing the color all the time. Um, I like for them for once to actually change the actual design of the HUD and make it kind of look something like futuristic -y, like to go with the actual texture pack or the mod or, well not the mod, I mean like the, the mashup pack. Um, which would be kind of really nice. I'm sure they could do something about it. They're the ones programming the damn thing, right? So they got to be able to do something other than just changing colors. But other than that, overall opinion, I like it. I like it. Would I be able to build something in this? Eh, I don't know, because uh, that's pretty futuristic crap-looking blocks. And me, I'm old-school, kind of mythological and ancient kind of builder. I like that old stuff. So building the new stuff like this, I'm going to have to leave that to the modern builders that uh, do a really good job of it. But I'm an old school kind of guy, so I would have turned this into some kind of medieval castle layout. <laughs> Honestly, yeah, that's how it would have turned out for me. But anyways, everybody, I hope you like this review. I enjoy this map. It's really nice so far. And uh, let me know what you think in the comments below. So don't forget to like and subscribe, and we'll catch you next time. Peace.